Inventions. Discover more about famous inventors, the invention of the toilet, and more. Let's go. Good ping pong match, Lily? Chester and I had a lot of fun, and I'm gonna go for a bike ride with Willow later. Did you know that your ping pong paddle, your bicycle tires, and your athletic shoes all have the same material in them? Invention can be used for many things. Yep, and this invention is a super fiber. It was invented by the scientist Stephanie Kvalek, who accidentally discovered it when experimenting in her lab. The fiber must be pretty strong. Good thinking, Lily. It's five times stronger than steel. That's super strength! But steel is heavy. This super fiber is very lightweight. That's great! Because I wouldn't want to swing around a heavy paddle. And guess what? Heat is no match for this super fiber. I can't wait to tell the Polos all about super fiber. Actually, Lily, it's even in your smartphone. Wow! So sometimes one invention can lead to many other inventions. Chester! Guess what's in bicycle tires, ping pong paddles, and smartphones? Now let's tell. Plastic. Plastic is an amazing invention. It's used for many objects. Because it's so flexible, it can be shaped into many things. That's right, Marco. But plastic can cause big problems, too. It can litter our lands and even get into the water, like rivers and seas, harming our wildlife. And that's why we shouldn't litter. When we use plastic, it's often for a short amount of time. But Unlike food, it takes a long time to break down, while uneaten food breaks down and becomes part of nature again within a few weeks. In fact, it'll take 500 years for plastic bottles like these to break down. Look at all that washed up plastic. If we're not careful, the world could be covered. So how can we help to stop plastic being a problem, Marco? Apart from recycling it, I guess we could use it less. Great idea. Like shopping with reusable bags, not plastic ones. And use the plastic we have over and over again? Yes, just like this reusable water bottle. I'm on it. I've got my lunch in my reusable bag, and I'm ready to go. Now, let's... Hearing aid. Sometimes, people have trouble hearing. So scientists invented the hearing aid to help. Hmm, but how can something so small help people hear better? Let's investigate. Hearing aids have three main parts. 
a microphone, amplifier, and speaker. The microphone picks up sounds. So the sounds from here will be picked up by the hearing aid's microphone here. Yes. The hearing aid's amplifier makes the sounds stronger and sends them to the speaker. Which sends the sounds into the inner ear. So, the wearer of the hearing aid can hear the sounds around them. Wow! What an invention! Let's spell. Death. Mobility Inventions. Look at that race! There are so many ways to compete in sports. Some people have disabilities, which means their bodies work in different ways. Mobility inventions are made to help people move their bodies. Like these wheelchairs. You can see more mobility inventions in my scrapbook. Take a look. A bionic limb can be attached to people who are missing a part of their bodies, like a hand or an arm or a leg. And this is an exoskeleton. It can help people who aren't able to walk on their own. That prosthetic leg bends and springs as he runs. Wow! It's called a blade, and athletes without legs can use them to run. Wow! So many inventions! So many ways to move! Now, let's test your memory. Five. Telephone. Talk later, Willow. Whoa! What is that? That's one of the first telephones, Corby. That's a telephone? It kind of looks like a face. How did it work? You had to crank a handle to make a call. And then an operator would connect you to the person you wanted to contact. Telephones did get smaller. Wow! That's a lot to carry. And lighter and flatter. Until eventually, we had... Smartphones! So the telephone has been improved and improved since it was first invented. So it went from this... to this! Telephones sure have come a long way! Willow, I've got to tell you all about the Telefantastic Telephone! You'll never guess what they used to look like. Now, let's test your memory. Find the items that begin with... 